Hi everyone, it's Waxrod here, and welcome back to episode 51 of the Minecraft Let's Play series. Guys, thank you so much for watching that last episode. It was the world tour, just a celebration for getting to episode 50, and I just really wanted to thank you for letting us get that far. Honestly, it's uh, just amazing. Thank you guys for all the support. Um, speaking of support, if you guys like or enjoy anything, just feel free to like and subscribe to the channel. Uh, it really does help me out, and I do appreciate it. Uh, a few other things, if you wanted to join the Discord, feel free to. It's in the description down below. And also, uh, what's that last thing that I usually talk about? Oh yeah, duh. And also, Twitch. If you want to follow me on Twitch and catch a live stream, definitely feel free. But uh, you might have noticed there's a couple new things around town. And I'm about to show you. I, uh, I downloaded this mod called Better End. I know I've been downloading a couple mods lately. It's a, it's a lot of good mods, and so you'll see... There are these f blue flowers here. These are called, I'll actually just shear them so you can see. If I shear this, it's a mossy glow shroom fur. And I found them in this biome in the nether that we travel to on stream. It's super fun. But yeah, I figured, you know, I'd just show you the around. Like, we got these little plants around everywhere. They're so nice. Like, look at this. It's just a nice little purple plant. I'm going to keep adding these around town. Like, this, look at, and they add light too. They're glowing at night, dude. It is amazing i just add them around my house because i don't know i thought it was cool and i didn't want to add them too much because i'm not really sure uh because they don't like move with the resource pack with bsl which is fine but i don't want to add too much that doesn't move and make it seem like kind of cartoony you know i want to just be kind of subtle with it like just here and there i don't know i really like these but there's a lot of end blocks that we'll go through i'm gonna make a whole episode about it kind of like the episodes that we're about to make with all of the new biomes and stuff but there's also one other uh, mod that I downloaded and I'll just show you by kind of hopping in the air here and that is chunk animator check it this out boom everything just kind of hops up and just presents itself hello what's going on get some over here hello how you guys doing yeah, and so all the chunks just kind of rise to you it's pretty perfect honestly I love it dang there's actually a, sh a shaft back here oh my god how have I never been over here this is kind of crazy. Um, if there's a ch Okay, I just fell a lot farther than I thought I was going to. If there's a chest over here just out in the open, I'll get to it, but I don't see one. And honestly, I should probably head back home. But yeah, honestly, I think this is super cool how everything just kind of pops up. I was playing RL Clat, or I can't even talk, RL Craft um, a couple weeks ago. I actually downloaded it. I was trying to figure out how to get shaders onto it, but it's kind of difficult now that it's on Forge via Twitch. But, uh, but yeah, I mean, look at the town. Everything just kind of hops back into place. It's so cool, dude. I love this. Yeah, you can probably tell by the uh, title of this episode, what we're going to do is fly right over here. This is the area that I'd like to go. Oh my god, wait a second. Why are there so many chickens on this? Why are all the chickens over here? What is happening? Why are you here, dude? Why are you here? It's kind of nuts, honestly. We've got a uh, turtle. You, you're allowed to be here. You, you can be here anytime. You're, you're a good looking turtle. But these guys, uh, you got to go. Yeah, you can see at night that these are glowing, dude. It's, oh, dude, it's lovely. I love it. I love it a lot. Um, I can't wait to bring a bunch back. And the way that they grow on these, like, almost glowstone, it's, it's like a sea lantern, but it's, like, brighter and more beautiful, dude. It's, oh, it's amazing. And, uh, yeah, this is actually from a biome that I, I literally grabbed one of these. It kind of looks like it has a, a weird, like, face, but it's just a, a leaf. It's just leaves that are glowing. It's nuts, dude. It's nuts. These biomes in the better end are... The better end biome are crazy. Um, this better animals mod actually added tarantulas. So I'm always checking because I haven't seen them yet, but these are this is just a regular spider. Some tarantulas are just chilling around town though. Anyways, I'm just basically hopping back here because I had to sleep. But what I wanted to really get uh, to work on in this area, um, as we're finally getting over here, is a, a, a kind of a, a three by three uh, sticky piston spiral door. And I think it's going to go probably just honestly right here. And, uh, I don't know, I'll, I'll build something else right here. This might be, like, another pond or, or something. Maybe it could be, like, the more of the pond, and then I might actually have, like, a bridge going over here. That would be sick. But, yeah, I'm actually going to just, uh, make a 3x3 three three spiral door, and this is actually going to be Mumbo Jumbo's build. If you want to, uh, check out the tutorial, I'm actually just going to put it in the link in the description below. And, uh, yeah, I mean, uh, what we need to do is just build a, uh, a huge huge storage system inside this mountain and so i mean that's what's going to happen i have to build this spiral d door um I've, this, I'm, not, I'm not too not too good with redstone so we'll see how this goes all right this seems like a pretty nice space to be digging out we'll just probably go back one more layer i think because we want the i think we want the front of the door to be like 
one, two, three by three right here. I don't even know why I brought this much out. I don't think I even needed to do that really, but I think, yeah, this is a good place for the door. We'll just go three by three right here. Now, wiring this up with the redstone is going to be the hard part. So I'm pretty sure you just go like this. I'm pretty sure. And then I think we just honestly take, oh, wait, I left the rest of the redstone out here. And there it is. There it is. We've got the repeaters. I'm pretty sure you just put that right there. I need to break this out. And then Mumbo Jumbo does it. Oh, God, this is not the place to be. Definitely need to be out of here. Um, but Mumbo Jumbo definitely does a really good job of uh, explaining the this all the way through. Like, I, I'm probably going to be terrible at explaining this, which is why I'm not going to do it. And that moves forward like that. Perfection. Perfection. Um, but yeah, I mean, we're getting close. <laughs> Only laid a couple of sticky pistons, but it feels like we've gone a mile already. Well, it seems to be working so far. When I do this, it goes up, got the tower, and then you go back down, and it grabs it, goes back down. It's perfect. So, I mean, we're doing something right so far. Well, we, it, it doesn't look too pretty right now, but, I mean, we'll cover it up. But, I mean, it looks decent as of right now. We just need to make sure it works. And that it almost works. Almost works. Almost works. Something is wrong. Something in here is messed up. It is almost working. Whoa, actually, wait. That actually pulled it all the way out. Wonder, I wonder what happens now. Okay, something in there is wrong. Because it does, after a couple tries, pull the rest of it out. So, like that. Okay, so it's <laughs> that's kind of weird. Alright, we'll have to figure this out. So after maybe about, I don't even know, man, it's, it's been, it's been a while, it's been a long time, but I'm pretty sure we got it, you click it, it goes boom, spiral, you click it again, it goes boom, spiral, done. Yes, dude. Yes, dude. That's what I'm talking about. But, um, but yeah, I mean, now we can basically hop in here because, I mean, once we find a way for this to go up to kind of have a lever to go out, I kind of want a bridge to go in here because I'm going to extend this pond probably, that's going to be super fun. Um, but once we kind of make it so none of the redstone out here is showing, um, then we can actually make it start to look nice. But what I'm going to do is just go in here and uh, probably on stream, I'm just going to start digging this out. This is, we're going to have a bunch of terracotta, but, uh, but yeah, this needs to be dug out here. And, uh, that is the way that we're going to have the storage system built. We just have to basically dig out a giant cave. It's going to be amazing. I could use TNT if I wanted to. That would, that might be fun, but... Yeah, now you guys can see a little bit where this is going. It's going to be nice. I'm going to probably cover this up with a little bit more chiseled stone to make it look nice, and then probably start digging this out. So I'm just finishing up the uh, end. Uh, I'm pretty sure the end, it's all still working, so we can just cut it out there, and I think that might be it. But basically just made a new door, and I think it looks nice. It looks pretty nice. It just kind of blends in. I just had the wool kind of go over it. I had to bring the wool out just a little bit more. Maybe it might take that red right away right there. Oh, actually, never mind. That exposes that. Well, actually, we could just put that there instead. I wonder if that... Do the same thing right here. Yeah, let's just do that. Perfect. That kind of just brings it out a little bit. And then, uh, yeah, I mean, I'm probably going to put a spruce trap door right here. Then you can just open it up. Bam. You can go in. Bam. It is working just fine. The only thing about this little cave right now that we dug out is that... Oh, there's some gold. Uh, is that uh, there's it. this place is going to be spawning mobs like crazy. So... I think as soon as we walk in, I, I kind of want there to just be like a, like a, maybe just some glow, just, just some light, basically. So I kind of want there to be just a super bright entrance. As soon as you walk in, you got this. I think that's good. I think that's sick. And so that's just, uh, that's the way it's going to be for now. I put the, the sea lanterns down here as well, because I thought it'd be cool if the, uh, le the lever, I mean, down here was lit up when I went to go close it, but... The only thing that's bugging me right now is that I kind of have to walk up and look down to hit the lever, and which is fine. And also, something that I realized is that once I'm in here, it's, uh, I can't really close the door unless I have another leather ho lever hooked up. So I, I really got to figure this out. Uh, this is just a, a, something that I just realized right now is that I, uh, just me not knowing anything about redstone over the years is just really, really taking a toll for this build because I... Uh, I mean, I'm just starting to regret not, like, learning about as much redstone as I really should have. Get in there, bud. Nope, never mind. But yeah, I mean, my recommendation after doing this is definitely just slowly learn redstone as soon as you can, because the longer you wait to to learn about it, the, the longer it's going to take you to finally just figure out, uh, like, you know, I need to do a 3x3 piston door, and then, all right, you try to start doing it, and then, bam, it takes, a, like, two hours instead of... Uh, like six minutes like mumbo jumbo did like you know it just it just takes a while 
So we actually, we quite, I found this bow and I'm just trying to get this skeleton now. Stuff is starting to spawn in here because the amount of space that we have in here is enormous. Like check all of this out. This is absolutely wild. Like there's so much space out here now. Um, as you can see, we do have haste two on. And so, I mean, we've just been doing the efficiency five haste two. Uh, you know how it is. But yeah, you walk out here, we got the beacon, finally full powered. I decided to just plop it right outside. I had no idea where to put it, so I just put it here for now. Because it does need an opening, so figured, you know what, let's just let it be. But yeah, man, I mean, we just got to keep digging this out a little bit more. So I think we kind of went a little bit as far as we can this way, because I kind of started popping into it. Wait a second. Oh, it's just XP. But I kind of started popping into some wool over here, and so uh, I'm probably going to start leaving that alone. Go up a little bit further this way. And probably just make it around this way over here. What are what is going on right here? What do you got in your hand? Is that an egg? It is just an egg. Why am I using this bow? I have no idea. Big onsa. Dude, this is actually taking quite a that was taking a long time. Oh, you're holding a thing. You're holding an ingot. Give me that ingot. Uh, but yeah, I mean, all the way over here is just quite a bit of space. Also, I mean, we can just kind of smack all of this out and. I mean, the haste just kind of brings it all... Oh. Okay, so if I'm going to run over here, these guys are just going to be up and out. I need to... No. I need to make sure that this is mob-proof. Like, oh my god. Stuff just started spawning here like crazy. Where's my other bow? That's the real question. Probably just light this up a little bit, and that spider is just stuck, but we'll let him be. You can just stay where you are, buddy. Uh, but yeah, I mean, this is looking pretty good. We dug it out quite a bit. We're just gonna have to run around, dig it out just a tad bit more, and then probably just come right back to you guys. Well, we've pretty much, uh, pretty much gone over everything. I mean, all of this is pretty much done. I mean, we can, I mean, we can even, like, hit rockets throughout this place. This place is enormous, dude. This place is enormous. Uh, what I did, though, was, uh, wow, this place is really big. Uh, one thing I did what, that you probably can see now that I'm up here is, uh, oops, I went up here and uh, I've been digging out up there about, this goes like maybe I think 11 high, 11 blocks high, but as you can tell I've been hitting the sides of Rainbow Mountain here, so I kind of stopped going that way as soon as I hit that, stopped going this way, and then I was like, wait, I can kind of go this way, there was a lake, there was like an underground lake right here that I had to clear out. That's why there's some cobblestone right there, but I mean, yeah, it's starting to go a little bit better. I ran, I was starting to get out of the space, out of the area for the beacon, and uh, since the beacon needs to be exposed by the sun, I figured, you know what, let's hop up and just dig a big hole in the sky here, and uh, let's let the beacon do its job. I think this will just lead up right to the area next to the wizard tower. I'm pretty sure, at least it, it should, it should. Uh, oh god, now it's just, it's super dark. We're just gonna have to look up and Hope for the best. Okay, so I officially can't see anything. All I hear is just like skeletons and stuff, so I'm getting back down, and I mistakenly... Okay, that's great. I mistakenly popped a hole right back in here. That's fine. Let's, uh, I mean, let's go back up. I brought the torches back up. That was just crazy. I couldn't see a thing. I need to just go up and just like... Can I not do that? Yeah. Nope, I can do that right there. Where is everything? What is up in here? Is this a creeper? Is this just a... What was all of this? I just popped up. This was just terrifying. There was just... I thought I heard a creeper or saw a creeper. I don't know what happened, but I'm gonna have to actually just plug this back up. Well, we poked through, and now we can just hop back down and... Just kind of make it clear. It's not like too far down, but it should be okay. So we can just plop that in there. It should be good. It should be lightened up now. Yeah, as long as it has a hole, a way to get to the top, it should be good. Shouldn't be any mobs hopping down. That'd be, that'd be not that good if stuff started hopping down that hole, but it should be all right. We're going to actually turn haste on. I want to turn haste two on. Let's put a diamond in there. Turn it on, dude. Yes, haste two is what you need. I need to... I need to eat also that is that's also what I need but dude I need the haste it's just so oh my god this is it's so needed like I started doing this I start like pretty much in this area that I'm in right now it started to become out of range of where the beacon was previously and dude it started to become a hassle like now that I'm in, now that I have the beacon there's there's no ever there's no going back ever all right so we are just heading right back in here might as well get some beef but I feel like we cleared this place out pretty nicely. Yeah, like, this is a lot of space. Like, enough space that I can take an entire rocket trip 
around. I can take a couple rockets around. Like, this is nice. This entire back wall right here is just crazy, dude. There's just a lot. There's just too much space. We have a lot of space. Like, there's going to be a lot of room for storage, dude. This is going to be crazy. Or this is, yeah, this is going to be nuts. So what we needed to do is probably start right around here. I've watched a couple videos, Impulse SV. Um, I watched uh, Chapman and... Uh, pixel rifts on the survival guide just a lot of different um, tutorials for this. They're all about the same I'm gonna do it. I would recommend actually watching their videos as well um, on this There are way too many videos on this and everyone has just slight differences I'm just gonna build it right now and just try to do the best that I can. I do know you just need a few uh, repeaters bunch of redstone Dispensers, I think you need droppers to be able to lift it up into where it's gonna be going initially But I think maybe we should create more of an entrance First, maybe we'd have it starting like out here. Um, I might need to grab some blocks. I also brought a stone cutter with me. I forgot about that. I need to bring this over here. We have an entire little base set up over here now. Um, let's see. Let's see. Uh, I actually don't need that yet. Let's just grab... You know what? We can just build with terracotta because I don't really want to use it for anything else. So I'm just going to build with regular terracotta in the back here. But uh, I'm starting with the pretty regular design. I think I want to go up a little bit. I'm actually just going to practice how tall this is going to go, but uh, bear with me. I'm actually just going to I'm going to dig build up real quick and just see how this is going to go. Well, we we got it working. Um, now all I got to do is basically just get this glass back in action here. Um, I was kind of just working around where exactly I thought I wanted this to go, but I think we just needed to go here because we just want the water to flow right here. I'm actually just gonna let this go. Yeah, that was it. There's all 64 right there. And I think that can go here, and then this can continue on this way because we want the water to be able to flow. No, wait, actually, this I'm pretty sure, oh man. Also, yeah, I broke my silk touch pickaxe, so luckily I have a silk touch shovel, but I'm pretty sure these right here are just gonna be hoppers. So what we would wanna do, so we have hopper going into chest, Going into hopper, going into chest. Let's do this. We actually might need to break it down a level. Let's do that as well. Let's see what this looks like. All right, well, I'm pretty sure we got all of this worked out. Like, back here we got all the redstone hooked up, and up here we got all the chests hooked up. So, got cobblestone and stone and polished stone just kind of to start off with. And then pretty soon I'll start like uh, building like a water ramp so I can kind of just come into the also by the way I'm missing the sea lanterns here now because a creeper came and exploded it while I was not recording creepers are always exploding when I'm not recording I don't understand why they're doing that but they are uh, but this is basically all hooked up I basically just need to get a water pump from like basically down here hooked up to go over right into this chest or on top of this hopper uh, if I just put everything in here like cobblestone that'll get plopped right out into these hoppers and it goes right into this guy right here if i since i've only hooked up the cobblestone and stone if i hook up something that's not that like granite let's check out what happens it just gets sent it just gets sent to the next nearest one well i'm also standing here but uh it gets sent to the next nearest and uh these aren't going anywhere because oh yeah because they're gonna be taken up in the hopper but dude i am excited about this i am gonna probably have to like this is going to be huge this is going to be a huge project. This is probably going to have to be done over a live stream or two, most likely. And so, uh, guys, if you want to catch a live stream, be there on Twitch. Wax Rod on Twitch, feel free to come. Uh, but no, seriously, it is, uh, it's, like, that's, that's the way it's going to have to be. We're going to have to do this on the live stream because I just simply do not have the time. Simply do not have the time. Well, as you can see, we have finally, we've finally done it all. This is absolutely crazy. Might as well just pull a rocket out. Guys, this is nuts. Look at all of this. Okay, I hit the wall pretty hard twice just there. Dude, this whole thing. This whole thing is just this. There's so many. Why? Like, I, I definitely don't need this many, but here we are. Here it is. Um, so I brought everything down by two levels, you can see. I uh, just wanted to make sure that it actually I forgot to take these guys out. But I brought down everything by two levels because I wanted to put an extra one right here because I want the... Um, item frames to go on this one and I'm gonna have a couple of like maybe some upside down stairs going up with some glowstone and the structure of the ceiling and the walls can start to go up from here you can just pick everything up from these guys I actually did before I start to take some of this out I actually did set up I reset this up I made a observer elevator so we can just hop and look it in here 
Uh, it's an observer elevator, so we got stuff going into the hoppers, got into the comparator, into the repeater back. I almost hooked it up accidentally up to the uh, the piston door. Actually, let me just double check to make sure this still works, and it does. We are golden, perfect. But yeah, uh, just got a bunch of observers going straight up. It's so just an observer elevator, an observer observerator, whatever you want to call it. Um, oh no, it's a dropper elevator. I forget. A dropper vader. Anyways, you just put a bunch of stuff in here. You can go bam, bam, bam. Uh, let's put some spruce logs. It just takes everything. It takes, I just put it into the chest right here and it just pops it right up into there. And it just goes. It goes all the way around. And now I have, I put in some spruce logs. There's no place for the spruce logs to go yet. So there should, if I did this right, they should uh, go all the way around. And now just to double check, yeah, it looks like everything is still going. And if you want to just double, double check, you can just walk right over here under everything. And you kind of just stand right here. It looks like this is where everything's been going so far. Uh, a bunch of just extra stuff that I don't have set up um, has just been going into here right now. And then we can just kind of gently wait. So it should be around in the corner any second now. If we kind of just roll over the... Yep, exactly. There it comes. Just boom. It just comes right here. It takes about like a total of maybe 30, 40 seconds. And it comes all the way around full circle. Just fills this guy up. This is everything that I haven't put into spots yet. And so we have basically all the stone stuff. We got cobblestone, regular stone, chiseled, stone bricks, everything. And then they got cracked and mossy. And I've started to do the gravel, um, flint, got coal. And then I started moving in. Oh, wait, what are you doing in there, bud? Started moving into some other stuff too. But uh, we got a ways to go. Like a ways to go. I actually did. Oh, yeah, I forgot about this. Um, let's just, you know what, let's get this before we forget. Let's just get the rest of this. I did forget about this huge cave. I, for, I forgot, like, I was, uh, you can see right here where I was just like, nope, and then I just built over it. I was like, I'm forgetting about this right now. I didn't think I would run into it again, but now that I'm going down two more levels, here's a giant ravine. I forgot, I literally already went down there once because I fell down there and I wasn't recording. I was on stream. Luckily, I didn't die because I got feather falling, but, uh, but yeah, kind of dangerous. Kind of dangerous. I fell over by that water, though, luckily, too. But yeah, as long as we are avoiding that, we are good to go. I'm just going to plug this guy back up. I'd rather not have to deal with this guy anymore. Perfect. One thing I am kind of nervous about is this right here, this guy right here. I did make sure all of these repeaters are off. I accidentally turned on a couple of these repeaters, but... These repeaters, like, going into each other onto the same block with redstone on it, I don't know if they're going to work. So I might end up having to put the same... Um, oh my god. I actually didn't even finish this up right here. How dare I? There's just hoppers and chests waiting to be placed. Wait a second. How could I not finish this? We got some hoppers right here. Let's grab some of these. Let's turn these into... Ch oh, buddy, and you also. What are you doing coming at me? Get out of here, bud. What are you doing over here? Get out of here. So just made another stack of chests. We have a stack of hoppers and a st over a stack of hoppers and over a stack of chests. This should finish it. I can't believe I missed this. That's just, uh, wow. I can't believe that. Let's go one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. Don't know why I'm counting. It doesn't, don't need to be counting. Um, let's just make sure. I really hope I did all of these right. That should be touching. Oh, gosh. Don't do that. I don't even have my axe on me right now. Maybe I do, but it's too late now. I already broke it. Let's go back. Oh, God, I'm all flustered. I thought I had it all f finished, and I, I just ended stream like an hour ago, and then I just completed all of this, and I figured, you know what? Let's just turn the recording back on and show everybody what we did. Super proud of it. Just need to decorate it now. Um, the only thing is I just forgot all of this, and now I'm flustered. I need to uh, put these hoppers back on, too. Let's actually just come back to you as soon as I have all the rest of these hoppers on. And I think we're going to have barely enough. We have one, we have eight left. And I think I did all of that. Did I just hear a creeper fall? I thought I did at least. That was not good. I don't like that sound. All right. So we got all of the hoppers going down this way. All of the hoppers going down this way. Perfect. Let's hop out. I need to eat. That's for real. Um, I was thinking what I'm going to do to decorate this place is I kind of want to go back to the ceiling. There's uh, If you check it, there's a live stream. It was from 323 a live stream where we went and checked out the better end mod and there was some ceiling there was a bunch of like glow shroom lights on the ceiling they were blue and it was amazing so i was thinking i wanted to kind of do the same thing here i figured i figured you know what that would be kind of cool that'd be kind of cool but for now for now i figured you know what let's get to decorating i started i kind of wanted to do something like this where it's just kind of all separated by these 
wooden logs and uh, it just looks good. I go up like this and basically you won't be able to tell what's behind here except for the item frames and the chest. Once we like, I kind of want to put some upside down stairs. I don't even have any stairs on me so I couldn't even really show. Oh my god, dude. How did you get here? How did you get here? You're done. So now I need to light this place up, basically just block everything off so that I can see basically all of the little crevices, nothing can be popping out anymore, and then this is just a big, giant room. But you know what, we might make a second episode out of that, I'm not sure. Might not have time. And you know what, yeah, let's do it. On that note, let's just, just fly around in here just for a little bit. I mean, this is sick. Why not just chill? Uh, no, I'm just kidding, no time for chilling, we gotta decorate. Guys, uh, yeah. Thank you for being here. This was super fun. If you were here on like either of these streams, it took two, like it was two hour streams, two of them. One of them I couldn't upload as VOD because there's some copyrighted music. I can't find which song is doing it, but it one of the songs on the stream is doing it. Got to locate it in the playlist and I will, and uh, I'll get it removed. But uh, it's one of the good ones. I know it is. I just got to figure out which one. Um, just haven't done that yet. But yeah, guys, if you end like or enjoyed anything, just please feel free to like and subscribe. Uh, it really does help me out, and, and uh, yeah, I, d I do really appreciate it. If you want to catch a live stream like where we built all of this, and probably what we're going to do on the next episode is do a live stream of decorating this thing as well. It's probably going to take a while. Probably going to take a good long week to decorate this whole thing. It's huge. It's huge. So yeah, it's probably going to take a couple more streams. Um, but yeah, if you want to join the Discord, feel free to join the Discord. It's in the link down below. And until next time, just take care of yourselves. Seriously, thank you so much for being here. Love you guys.